Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Banning Advisor of Pencil. We tried to in the previous episode. We were. What did we do on the previous episode? I cannot remember at all. Oh, it was Tainted Isaac. And unfortunately, we did get a little bit in a little bit of a sticky situation. Didn't get too far. Let's go this time and do Lilith and try and go and do Megase. And unfortunately, it's not exactly the best unlock of all time. But do you know what? Since Repentance, I gotta say, I've enjoyed Lilith a lot more. And do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? <laughs> what the fuck? I enjoy it quite a lot when I get Tech X as my first item. <laughs> oh, baby. Do, 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 do. Oh, my God. I'm in a good mood now. Just woke up. Well, I said just woke up. I've been up about an hour. Not in a good mood. Why would you do this to me? Horrible game. Why would you do this to me? But we should be fine. Tech X here. As long as we can get some soul hearts along the way. This is an XL floor, right? Nope, it's not. Whoa, that enemy almost hit me there. Um, Really should have gone to a smaller room before doing this room. But honestly, Tech X should absolutely slay this room. Just be careful for the splitting... The splitting little flies, they can get you really easily. But yeah, we're on one heart, one soul heart now. Well, one black heart. So we do need to be careful. We are in a promiscuous position. But Maggie's fate is fucking amazing for us. Holy shit, this is a really good run. Okay, health is kind of sorted now for us, which is really, really nice. Um, I'm going to go and do this long room down here as well. But yeah, Maggie's faith, getting a eternal heart at the start of every single floor... We were likely to be able to keep that alive. So that is really, really good for us. Really, really good for us. Just keep the tech X's a going. Try and full charge it whenever possible. Check out our shop here. The Bible. I'm okay for the Bible, thank you. I don't need the Bible. But yes, tech X to start. Can't be in conception with one hit on it already. Maggie's fair. The recharge box. This is it's all good shit, my dudes. It's all good shit. My good golly grace. And a health up as well. Sorry, Trinket. Whatever you are, I'm probably not going to take you. Remember, we're going Angel Deals this time. We want to try and go to Mega Satan. So we want to save up our bombs and all that good jazz. Uh, but, yeah. Just a fantastic position to be in right now. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I love the way the, the tech items carry bombs now. It's a change of repentance that's really small and kind of, you'd think, pretty insignificant. But it's, it's just so satisfying. Look at that. Woo! Goodbye, bomb. And we needed that bomb anyways for our angel statue. We always want to make sure we have at least one bomb on us. Because um, I'm pretty bad for that. I mean, notably, you guys have seen me uh, mess it up quite a few times. Okay. Look at this beautiful, beautiful game. Giving me all that I need. I, I just can't believe. Like, I get so lucky. I mean, people say, like, I, I talk to people on my Discord about it. Like, uh... Brittle Burns is actually pretty good. Um, I think I will take it. Um, yeah, Brittle Burns is pretty amazing for us here. Uh, but yeah, like, people, I've, I've spoken to people on my Discord about it. It's like, I have just... Beautiful. Oh, I shouldn't have taken that yet. God damn it. Uh, I have, like, the biggest case of, um, of YouTuber luck. It just... It's crazy. It's absolutely nuts how, uh, how lucky I get in some of these runs. I mean, sometimes, not so much, but... I, I really don't that often, like, um, delete recordings. If something happens, then you guys get to see it. Uh, so, like, the just frequency of good runs for me is is just abnormally high. Um, but yeah, Brill Burns here is very, very good. Lots of tears up coming our way. Uh, do not want a bad trip. I mean, I'll keep it because it's technically a thingy. Uh, health up once we get to low enough HP. Come on, Soul Heart. Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to try and Brittle Burns it now. I think there's not much point, really. Um, but yeah, when we lose those Burn Hearts later, we'll get Tears Ups, which is fantastic. But just in general, when you have low HP, it's just a pretty huge HP up, which is great for us. Um, take what, whatever we can here. And there you go. <laughs> Easiest room ever. And another Heart as well. Yeah, this is, we are on a fantastic HP. Basically, the one thing I'd say that'd be really good to get now is a flat damage upgrade. Give us, like, Stapler, give us Pentagram. Something along those lines would really hit the spot right about now. Boom. 
Okay. Also, another great thing. One of the biggest downsides, in my opinion, of Lilith is the shots uh, being slightly delayed from the Incubuses, but that really doesn't matter with TechX, like, at all. Good stuff. Boom. Boom. And boom. And we go down to the next floor. Holy shit. How have we ended up with this much HP? God diggity damn. We are on such high HP. And we got a mega chest as well. Heck yes. I'll do I'll definitely do that if we get the keys for it. We we really need at least seven keys. Okay, do not bomb that tinted rock yet. We only have one bomb. We need to see if we can get an angel deal first, and then we'll come back for it if we don't. My god. Just It's just craziness. And I love it. Like, we were we were on the ropes with our HP a little bit, and the game was like, oh sorry. Uh, I'm just gonna give you Maggie's Faith and then Brittle Bones. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to uh didn't mean to offend you, your your royal YouTube highness. You've got to have the best run possible. Okay, there's our second bomb. We are good to bomb that tinted rock. Give me small rock. I could really do with a small rock right about now. Ah, soul heart. It'll do. It'll do. Um, okay, don't really care about that. Secret room is a little less less useful at the minute. I mean, I'd like to go to it if we get the bombs, just because I want more bombs and I want more keys. Especially want more keys. I really want to get up to eight keys this floor because it guarantees we can open the mega chest and our item room. And I think that's kind of like the, the bar to entry for me at the minute. Oh, you've managed to hit me there, Squire. There's another key. Going well. Lil Dumpy. Sadly, not great, but it is a familiar. It is a familiar. So I will take it. It is a zero quality familiar, but it is a familiar. Do you know what? This is definitely a room where I should be using this. Yeah, just please. Oh, the incubuses aren't quite fast enough. Hey, little Dumpy just helped out a ton. Thank you. Even if you're aimlessly doing nothing for the most part, as long as you come in clutch when we need you. Okay, we've got a sack room here. Don't really want to play the sack room at the minute. Um, but I wanted to check it for the soul hearts and all that jazz. Um, I will get that key if need be. Chop you down. Oh, come on now. Right, let's go do our boss now because we've got a charge. Okay, this is an annoying boss. Take out this half first. It's way more deadly. Oh, my farty babies. Do your thing. Oh, you bastard. Okay, to be fair, that was fine because I would have been hit by the other half anyways. We got our angel deal. Uh, sadly, the, the pony we cannot take. We do have a bomb as well. Soul Locket here is pretty darn good. Uh, we can't afford to open up these chests. Soul Locket, by the way, whenever we pick up Soul Heart Health, we get um, a stat increase. Really, really good. Kind of like the Candy Heart, but uh, for Soul Hearts, very, very good indeed. Okay, unfortunately, this is a very terrible boss for us um, in terms of our damage because he moves around so much that we really don't get much damage off on him with the uh, with the Tech X rings. Means for makes for quite a difficult boss fight, and it takes quite a long time, as you're currently seeing. I really don't want to accidentally walk into the chests or anything either. Even the little angels he spawns move around a good amount. It's just it's an absolute pain in the ass to kill this guy. He just moves too much. Most bosses, most enemies, honestly, don't really move anywhere near this much. So Tech X is way better against them. But for now, we'd actually be better off with Tears at the minute, apart from when he does this. For God's sake. I think the hitbox on the uh, on the angelic beams, by the way, is a little off. I always find it to, to like not be quite right. I get hit by it when I've, I really feel like I shouldn't have been hit by it. Okay, when you sit still like that, it's really good stuff for us. We're almost there. Holy hell, it's taking a while. We're almost there. Can you stop spawning the little bebskis? Yeah, I knew that was going to hit me. Honestly, at this point, I'm kind of okay with taking damage, though, because we have the soul locket. So, so do you know what? I, re I regret everything that I just said. How did I take so many hits from this little fucking Bebski? Go away. God damn it. I lost my eternal heart and everything. Big shitters. Big shitters. Very sad. Uh, do you know what? Quickly grab out the pony here. Let's go and get everything that's over the over the gaps. Oh my god, I lost way too much health there. But yeah, I was I was gonna say I'm kind of glad to have lost um glad to have lost it because then we can refill the soul heart health and get more stats. If we don't have space to pick up soul hearts, we can't get stats. 
So I was more inclined to have the space. Okay, we got seven keys now. That's great stuff. But the game's just been a bit of a a bit of a biatch. No, thank you. We've got something good already. Well, we will go in here as well because we get the uh, the flight. And there's our black heart that gives us some stats. Sadly, it was range, but another key is really nice. Boom, boom. Oh, we got Guppy, the Soul Converter. I don't think um, Soul Converter will give us the stats because we don't. We're not picking up the Soul Hearts; we're gaining them, which is completely different in terms of how the game sees it and how Soul Lock it'll see it. But of course, we do want to pick this up and uh, put it back down again. Of course, I did not mean to. Uh, Walk directly into the enemy that spawned there, but I was kind of I'd already said I was gonna pick it up. I'd already walked over there. I was committed. It was a bad idea yeah, You guys gotta go we really hope for double item from this rather than consumables and one of them being a damage up That damage while tech X is great is kind of piss poor Minimum keys, please minimum keys. Oh, it looks like it's gonna be a seven key. Oh, no, okay, so golden razor unfortunately terrible, but well, I, said, I wouldn't say terrible, but it's not good for us. Um, but the, the, the red hot chili pepper should be decent enough, I think. Uh, so open this up as well. More bombs. I think this is our secret room. Let's check it out. Indeed it is. More bombs. Great stuff. Second secret room. Is that on the cards? I mean, our shop is probably worth going to right now as well. Second secret room. I've just got to kind of figure out where it could be. It could be here. We've got plenty of bombs, so I'm okay to test this out a little bit. Could be off of the, the room before the boss as well. Let's go into our shop real quick. See what we get offered. Um, Unfortunately, nothing there, really. We don't want to buy any space bar items because we want to stick with our box o friendies. box o friendies. Um... Right, so it'll be off of one of these. So here. Or here. Or it won't be. Okay. I'm not going to spend any more time looking for it because I clearly don't know where it is. So let's move on. Carry on going. And see if we can get something good going this floor. I'm really hoping for a damage up this floor. Ooh, okay. Little Dumpy has some synergy with, um, with the bird's eye chili. Um, I can never remember what it's called. Is it just called Bird's Eye? But yeah, it has some synergy. Whenever he f does a little a little toot, it will um, produce a, a flame, which is great for us. I, I think it produces it from us as well, not from him. Like, it's the, the fart is located from us. I lost my eternal heart again. Honestly, at this point, I actually couldn't really care less about losing eternal hearts because uh, we have fantastic HP. It's nice if we can keep them, but if we can't, I'm, I'm really not going to worry about it. That's a lot of HP. Um, that's a lot of HP. Really wish I had my box for this room. Would be far more useful in this room. But lots of stationary enemies. Should mean not too bad of a time for us. Goddamn, those fires doing good stuff. Extra bomb. Come on, item room. Do it to me. Give me something good. Or an angel deal just give me something good. That would also hit the spot just right. I'm surprised that when you take a when you get an angel deal, you pick up the item and kill the statue and get the key piece, you can still have a 12% chance of a devil deal. I would have thought it would be much less than that. Oh my god, yes. Any enemies that can be knocked back. Things great against. Um ooh, that is a good room if we need the money. We should definitely check out our shop just in case because of that. Okay, be careful. These enemies can be a bit unwieldy. This thing. This bloody thing. Got him. Um, yeah, we're going we're gonna to pop in here anyways and check. I definitely want um, this. I'm just... I'm just going to bomb these because that money's kind of hard to get. I know it's lazy, but we all need two coins. Gives us a black heart, but it also gives us curse immunity, which I fucking love. Curse immunity is so good. So many curses that are just a, a really, a really bad, mild annoyance. <laughs> Damn, I was really hoping that would be the secret room because then we'll be able to get into our mob trap. I think it'll be here, actually, next to the curse room. Right, you need to go. Where are you coming up? Oh, fuck. Fuck me, goddamn. Yeah, I think it'll be here, actually. Boom, bow. Oh my god, I am 
shitting the bed when it comes to secret room finding at the minute. I hate this room. With a passion. And I will take multiple hits of damage. Right, we got it. We got it. Don't need to use our box of friends for this room. This is easy. Got you as well. Keep on pushing on. Keep on pushing on. Ah, oh, I can't. I walked right into it. I walked right into it, didn't I? Don't lose the angel deal chance. 25% is a pretty good chance. Yeah, the little dumpy is actually really, really good with the chili pepper. Getting all these extra fires out there when possible is, is rather nice. You just you just keep on chilling. Give us a pill. I'll take the pill. I'm a risk taker. Health up. Yay. My goodness. We've got quite a lot of reserve health now. We're kind of okay. We're losing some burn hearts at this point. I would not be amiss. Ooh, hello. Soul heart for um, not only a soul heart, but also stats. And it gave, it gave us range, unfortunately, but it did give us some fire rate. Only a meager amount, but it did give some fire rate. Right. Got you. Please, come on. Oh, Libra. Libra's an interesting one. Oh, god damn. I, I really don't know about Libra. Because it could be good. And it does mean that all future stat increases are all stats up. But it could also just be terrible. And we've had problems with it in the past. And on charge up things, it's usually not that good. Quickly, let's check inside our arcade here. Oh, I really don't know. This is a very hard choice. I think it's a mistake, but I'm going to do it anyways. Okay, it gave us damage. Okay, overall, that was very positive. But it, it does mean that all soul hearts going to give us an all stats up. Also, it means that losing a burn heart gives us an all stats up, which I think is very important. Um, I do want to go into my cash room and probably lose a burn heart or two. Oh, it's mega fatty. This could, might be a long fight. Honestly, the fires are going to be so important for this guy. You can see how much damage that one just did there. The fires are going to be so important. Oh, my God. Oh, wait. Did we just get a Cambion Conception player? Or did I, did I use my space bar? We got a Cambion Conception player, and we got another Incubus. We th This run just blew itself wide open. We just got a free Incubus. That's so insanely good. Um... Right, so I'm going to go and take some damage. First of all, let's go into our cash room. Boom. And boom. And boom. All stats up. It's, it's kind of a minor all stats up, really, but I'm going to do it anyways. I'm going to do it three times. There you go. Kind of a minor all stats up, but the fact that we just got an incubus and we just we just played this to get closer to our next uh, our next Cam Conception play is pretty good. Why am I so bad at finding secret rooms today? What's going on? Something is amiss. Got to be somewhere over here. I think it's like yeah, no, it's not. What the hell is it? What's wrong with me today? What's wrong with me today? Probably here then, right? Okay, that's good. I'm not going to play you, but I will bomb you. That was a lot of money. Nice. Very nice indeed. Um, we, we might as well bomb this as well because we're blowing up mushrooms and we're getting our bomb back anyways. And then I'm going to go up to that, that big old money room and lob a bomb in the center. See what we can get and maybe buy restock. I think restock could be pretty good for buying soul hearts. Okay, we actually did a really good job of that there. Really good job of it, indeed. This could also be secret room. Let's check it. It's not... I, I just can't find second secret rooms. It's impossible. And I think it was restock that was in the shop, right? Yes, it was. Let's buy restock. Not super useful, I'll admit. But if we find a soul heart in the shop, it's a basically all stats generator. Um, if we have enough money to, to play it. Anyways, let's carry on going. Uh, very, very happy with how this run is, um, is forming. The fact that we got an extra Incubus for free without having to use our box is insane. Um, and will probably end up meaning that we get quite a lot going. I'm, I'm sad that the marbles didn't choke down our Maggie's faith. I would have loved to have taken Child's Heart or something. But anyways, let's carry on. Let's carry on going and see what we can get done on this floor. 
Definitely want to use our space back here. But yeah, now we get three of these boys. And we can easily knock away the bombs. Dead cat. Fucking very interesting game. Very interesting. See, we do want to take dead cat. Because we are uh, we are in a current situation where um, we have one guppy item already. So it would be very good. I don't know if it would take away my burn hearts. If it takes away my burn hearts, then I think it's a bad idea. If I can get some soul hearts this floor, then I'll do it. I need... To, do you know what? I need to find out. Because the thing is, if it does take away my burn hearts, I should get rid of them on purpose for brittle burns beforehand. So, um... Isaac... Dead cats. Dead cat. Um... Sets Isaac red health to, to one, um... Does not remove solar black hearts. It doesn't say anything about not removing burn hearts. Let me let me just search burn hearts on here. Boom. Okay. If Pixel is forgotten, his burn hearts are reduced, but soul hearts. Oh, okay, that's just forgotten. Um, I really don't know then. Burn hearts does not remove burn hearts unless Pixel is forgotten. Great stuff. That's fantastic to know. Did I accidentally minimize the game there? I might have done. Um. I reckon we just kind of go pick it up now, then. Why not? If it doesn't remove the burn hearts. Let's go for it. Let's go get it. Don't think there's anything we need to do with our HP. Boom, bow. Yep, that's really, really good for us. I mean, I do slightly regret removing some of those burn hearts on that last floor just for stats now. But, honestly, Maggie's Faith, if we can get at least two players on it from now until the end of the game... Like, I'll be really happy. And I'm sure we can. I mean, obviously, we need some soul heart protection for the current eternal heart we have. But we'll see. We'll see. Right. I just love our damage right now. It's so good. Single gray chest. No, thank you. Didn't need to pop this there, but I really wanted to just in case. But yeah, the, the great thing, the even greater thing, more so than the damage that we currently have with um, with that the double incubus, is more so the double knockback. We're going to lose it here. Yep, I, I knew it. These, these fucking fast boys plus incubus, just, you can see I can't hit him. He's just not dying. I just knew that was going to happen. Sad times. One room off the shop as well. Start a deck, a deck of cards, sorry, isn't really that good for us. I, I will take a moon card, though. Um, yeah, there'll be a soul heart in here, guaranteed. Okay, no, there isn't. Um, that makes me a little less salty, but <laughs> still. We'll grab that. Good. -er. Nah, Locust of Pestilence is good, but we need to keep our... Uh... Oh, okay. Don't lose a burn heart here, please. Oh, you motherfucker. That was the biggest stupid I've ever stupid. God damn it. That was so dumb. <laughs> I need I need soul hearts so I can get Maggie's faith going and the game just will not give me them at all. But yeah, the knockback from the incubus is so good for keeping enemies off of us. Right. Go do our boss fight. I want to get my uh my thingy going first. Space bar item. A box of oh, friendies. Right. I know we're going Angel Deal, so the, the, the last Guppy item isn't super guaranteed, but I think I think it's still a really good idea to pick up nine lives anyways. Like, I think we're in a situation where our health doesn't matter too much. I'm just... We really need a shop with soul hearts in it, and we need a lot of money, because it's going to give us a ton of stats. Oh, stop picking up that fucking trinket. It's going to give us a ton of stats, but more so than that, it's going to mean we have some insurance with our health. We, the good thing about getting this battery baby here is it is a familiar, so there's a chance that you get battery pickups during the fights. Good thing about that heart there as well is if we uh, get hit, we're not going to lose that burn heart, hopefully. Okay, just keep on pummeling this guy, hoping for the best. Oh my god, I hate the spiders. Stop doing this. I can't handle it. Okay, more fires. Good stuff. Oh my god, that's scary. 
honestly, that's really good for us. Uh, double stats up means a good old, good old all stats up. We'd prefer for more damage than 0 0.11, though. Uh, right. Down to the next floor. <sighs> I, I, I'm, I'm a little wary of this run now that we're losing a lot of health. We really need Maggie's Faith to pay off here. But it's so difficult for us to get that. Because uh, we're just getting no soul hearts at all. Like, we'll probably end up losing it in this room here, won't we? Dude, room, stop. <laughs> Room's so annoying. Right, I'm going to blow up some skulls here as well. Just to try and get a black heart. Or a card that gives us some soul hearts. There's the black heart. Okay. We're probably okay now for, for keeping this burn heart alive. Which is amazing. Uh, let's go and fight whoever this is. Yo, you are going to get absolutely mugged off, dude. Not only are you going to get knocked back on you so you can barely hit us, but... Bit of piercing. Bit of piercing's all we need. Right. Now where we go? We can do the extra rooms, I think. You know what? I'm gonna use this. I want the extra damage. Oh, I, I love this weird little dumpy synergy we got going on here. It's really good. Do not fart my stupid thing away. Oh my god, the clutchest of clutchness. Double soul heart gives us a bunch of stats. Th that was... That was a really good play there. We, we are in a much better spot now. Oh, of course I got hit by this fucking turret. Them turrets hit me all the time. Ooh, we just got a little brimstone for uh, Cambium Conception. That's really good. This is in a very good spot as well. Now what we need is King Baby. King Baby would be so good round about now. The world will keep it. Um, sadly, nothing really great for us here. But yeah, HP is now in a far, far better spot. And we're actually sitting pretty right now. But yeah, King Baby would really hit the spot right about now. So shops are kind of valuable to us. Hop in here real fast. Rubber Cement is insane. I mean, it used to be broken with Tech X, but they did patch that. Now it's just great. <laughs> it at least gets one extra bounce, which one extra bounce makes all the difference, honestly. That's going to be so much more damage for us. So much more damage. Got you. I'll bomb you two as well. That's kind of why I did it. Coupon is good, but do we actually do we actually want the coupon? I am going to take a bit of a risk with the coupon. I'm going to pick up the coupon and take it into Oh wait, no, I can't I take I can't take it into the boss fight with me. I was going to take it to the boss fight with me then I realized we're on Necro 2, so I can't do that. I won't be able to get out unless I bring a teleport card with me. Right. Do this room. Oh, for fuck's sake, the fucking masks. Stressing out about these heckin' masks. Well, Dumpy, get them. That's good. Two of diamonds, that's really nice. Keep that on us for now. Should I do them? Oh, God, yeah. Rubber cement plus Tech X is so fun. Not quite as broke as it used to be. By the way, when I say it was broken, when Repentance first came out... Uh, Tech X plus, um, plus Rubber Cement used to make the, the lasers just bounce forever. They just never stop. Which obviously was real broken. Good stuff. Pop in here. Sadly, yet again, no Soul Hearts. Which is just majorly disappointing. Majorly disappointing. Right. I think I'm just going to two of diamonds now then. Okay, we don't really need to full charge at this point either, unless we want to really get our little brim firing. We don't need to, to be perfectly honest. We don't have any bombs left, damn. We don't have any bombs left. I'd very much like bombs right now. Um, do I care? Let's go and at least see if the shop has a bomb. Right. In we go. Doesn't. This is kind of crazy. I will buy that, though. Sadly. No good. There's a bomb. I'll buy another one. That was unexpected. Kind of an annoying thing to have in the shop, to be honest. It's going to be kind of hard to get sometimes. I'm going to buy another sack. I want another bomb. Give me another bomb. I mean, technically, the tower is kind of a bomb. <laughs> I'll take it. This golden penny's just taking us all the way. This is a really good golden penny. 
My goodness, it just keeps going. It just keeps going. Nice one. Okay, so let's go over here. We're going to go into, I think it's this room here. Nope, next room. And we're going to tower card. We're going to drop out of the room. It only spawned three. Okay, I didn't realize that's, that would be how that works. We got this going. Good. There's our fool card. Then we bomb here. We're not making boss rush, obviously. Hey, this is a pretty cool room. That's a lot of bombs as well. Right. So now, my play is we're going to go back this way. We're going to grab the coupon. And then we're going to go fight our boss. And then we're going to fool card out. The reason I say to grab the coupon, do you know I'm just going to bomb through this wall, I'm too lazy, um, is because if we do get a deal with the devil, as you can see, we have a 37% chance, so it's not unlikely, whoopsie, if we do get a deal with the devil, we can then use the coupon on the deal with the devil so that we don't get deal with the devil precedent, but we do still get the angel deal chance. I think that's a pretty good idea, right? I hope. Let's, let's just do it. Right. Very much still in need of a decent damage upgrade here. So I think we'll take the negative because of that. That's a negative actually be an all stats up, so it's a good idea to take it definitely over the Polaroid. Okay, good. So we'll take the negative here. We'll go into here. We shall... Unfortunately, not give a shit. Actually, no. Duality is really good here. It gave us sulfur. Spawns devil and angel doors. When entering one, the other disappears. We have to take this. I think. Also, sulfur. Do I want to take sulfur or is Boxer Friends better? I don't know. I kind of think that Sulphur's better. I think that Sulphur will will do us better. I don't know, though, because we get an extra little brim and an extra little dumpy. Nah, we, we, we got to go with um, We got to go with it. So, basically, I have potentially screwed myself if this doesn't pan out. But in taking duality, my next deal should definitely contain an angel deal. So it should be okay, in theory. Our health is also very low now, which is scary. But we did keep our Maggie's Faith Eternal Heart, so we are going down to the next floor with some better chances here. Let's, uh, let's dip on down. But yeah, going into the womb and still not having the angel key is, is very treacherous. Oh, for fuck's sake. I thought we were going to take my, uh, my eternal heart there. I was so, so fucking uh, convinced. Yeah. Just keep going. Good. Hope we're going the right way. <laughs> Says that as he walks into dead end. Ah, that room scares me every time. Okay, so quickly reset the turrets and then run on through. Okay, just take our time with this because that turret's going to hurt if it hits us. I mean, everything hurts if it hits us, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. This is horrible. This is a really horrible room. Oh, thank God. That, that could have gone so much worse. Right. The good thing as well about taking a uh, box of friends here is it scales really nicely with a battery baby. We can get more charges in boss fights, especially at the Mega Satan fight if we manage to get in there. It works very well for us. Get you. Good, good. I hate this room, I hate this room, I hate this room, I hate these enemies. Please die. Oh my god. <laughs> the panic. It sets in so fast. Thank you for two pennies. Extra battery. Give me those baby batteries. Okay, I don't have to fight this guy, but we're on it anyways. 
could give us a really good card. I mean, Justice could give us a Soul Heart. Sadly, I did not. God damn. Th th this run, like, one floor was really good for it, but we've been kind of getting shafted for Soul Hearts at the minute, I think. Is that a secret room? Kind of looks like it could be. It is indeed. I kind of walked away thinking, no, it's not, but, but it's... Uh, we should definitely bomb these. Liberty Cap isn't going to really do it for us. We could get a health up pill, though. We didn't. I'm not going to take any of the pills. I know one of them could be balls of steel, but... I can't take the risk, Captain. I can't take the risk. Thank you for freezing all the enemies there. That helps out immensely. Good stuff. Extra bombs as well. And we push ever forward. I'm, I'm thinking overall of this whole run, Libra was probably the worst decision we made. Like, it's not been a bad choice by any means so far, but it's definitely been more negative than positive, I think. Although we haven't really received any straight-up damage ups, and that's what we'd be kind of looking for to alleviate that. I say it, and it happens. But yeah, that was not a good damage up, really, at all. I mean, it was better than nothing, but... Libra kind of screwed that. I'd rather just have the straight damage up. Good stuff. That that was that was very positive. Nice old stat stuff. I was really hoping for a soul heart, but you can't always get what you want. Oh my god, how did I not get hit just then? What on earth just happened? That thing just exploded. Right, boss time. If we can do this boss without getting hit, we'll get another heart, which is real good. I don't know how likely that is because this is a very annoying boss. But we do have a lot of power. Can you stop bouncing into little corners where I can't hit you, please? Stop! There you go. We got our angel deal there as well. So we're going to our angel deal. We have a bomb available. The wafer is fantastic here. And now, yeah, we've got we've got our uh, key piece. We've got our wafer. This is really good. This has put us in a much better spot. And we are killing angel statues way faster than I was, was ex would expect. Duality ended up being the right choice for us there. Duality's not really saved me too often, but in this time it did. And I got to keep my eternal heart too, so our health is looking even better. This need this this needs to have a crane game. It didn't. I was really hoping for a crane game there. We need more items, really. We need more items. We need more stats. Because 5.6 damage for Mega Satan, even with Boxer Friends Tech X and all this jazz, not great. Right, there's a there's a red nubbin somewhere in this room. Oh, I think I killed him by accident. Okay. No, there is not. Right, you're dead. Just keep firing here. I need to try and charge it to let little brim fire. I'm not really giving him his chance to shine. Good stuff. A nickel there, unfortunately not great. Yeah, we haven't had any more Cambion Conception players yet, but we're probably pretty close to our next one, I'd, I'd imagine. Go away from me, you stupid enemies. God damn, this floor is just full of arsehole enemies. Can we get to this? I don't actually know. Ooh, hello. That's good. Gives us some, a small amount of stats. Ah, oh, really? <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> the worst crawl space I've ever seen. A terrible item. Okay, good. Just keep pushing forward. This is a... Oh my god. How did I not get hit there? I am surviving some stuff that I should not be surviving. My goodness. Yep, got hit. Knew it, but we got our attack. We had a soul heart protecting us. Let's just hope we don't get hit again in the boss fight here. Okay, that's good. Keep her going. Good, good. Nice one. We kept the eternal heart. We're going down right. Yes, we are. Okay. Oh my goodness. Goodness, very much need some extra soul hearts still, but we are doing okay on health now because of um, the eternal hearts we've been getting from Maggie's Faith. Maggie's Faith on the first floor, literally the best time you can possibly receive it. Okay, Brimstone Ghost here. Try and ignore the Brimstone Ghost for a minute while we take out these guys and then deal with them in a second. 
really annoying when the ghosts and stuff spawn really close to the walls because Tech X has a really hard time hitting those sort of enemies. Those sort of angles, should I say. Right. Damn it, no soul hearts. Big old sad. Okay, this is a really tough room for us here, so let's be careful. Those enemies charge at you. I mean, these charge at us as well. All charge enemies. Okay, they all charge directly into those spikes. That's that's kind of the perfect formula for us, really, isn't it? We have a hard time with the enemies. The enemies decide to kill themselves. Who could have asked for a better solution? Oh, because there's just fires everywhere as well. This is great. Blackheart, yes. All stats up and health. Okay, get in those bouncy bouncies. And away we go. Uh, no thank you. No thank you. <laughs> Every time I come across that room, I'm like, yep, bombing out of it. I'm not I'm not doing this room as it's intended. No way, no how. God damn. Brimstone Ghost, you are annoying. Please die. Get onto our boss. Yeah, don't get hit. I want to keep my uh, my eternal heart again, if possible. We should be able to keep it here. We should. Right. Stay still. Good stuff. You are Dunzo. And as are you. Okay, you're going to brimstone me. That's okay. You got him. Okay, just this this version of Satan is always the one that hits me. This this phase, the second phase isn't too bad, and unless he uh, telefrags you with one of the little uh, little leeches, that seems to happen a lot to me. Like that, yeah. It's not like I'm gonna say it's not really even the fact that the leeches exist. It's more so that you try to avoid the leeches and in turn get hit. But there you go. We kept our eternal heart. We're down here. We got our uh, our mega certain key. We should be pretty good to go here. We've got a lot of HP now. Um, we might want to trade some of it away if we get anything good, like Guppy. She's got Guppy. Uh, we definitely want to take this Guppy item. It's the first time we've had Guppy in Repentance. We are on episode, what, like a hundred and fucking, I don't know. We're, we're, we're in it. We're in the shit. And we finally got Guppy. First time, right. Let's get Box of Friends ready. Really the worst possible room. But Guppy should have pretty much assure this victory, I'd say. Right, let's get in there. Hopefully battery babies proc a good amount and give us some extra battery charges in this fight. Give us some extra stuff to go with. But Guppy, even though we don't have tons of damage, Guppy should kind of assure this victory, I think. Oh, little Dumpy just farted all those tears away at me and it kind of confused the shit out of me. Taking out you first because you're the most annoying. Oh, the bouncy tiers in this area are so good. Also, the fires. We're getting a lot of fires. Oh, you knew you were fucked. Before you even spawned, my dude. This guy should be careful. The creep. The creep's still there. I had to, I had to stay there because the creep was still there. Troll bombs and everything. We've still got our eternal heart. Okay. That was just about to say it's good because it protects us from damage for one hit. The Eternal Heart is worth something to us. We, the Guppy, the Guppy transformation has done so much for us here. We've almost got an additional charge as well, which is nice. The hands are dead. Oh, I'm so bad at predicting that. But remember, I keep forgetting we've got the wafer. We have a lot more health than it looks like we have right now. A lot, lot more. A lot, lot more. Like, that doesn't mean that we shouldn't endeavor to make sure we're dodging. Especially in these harder attacks. Thank you, little Dumpy, for carving out a path for me there. There's a charge. There's a charge over there. I can't see anything right now. I'm going to get hit a few times during this. Oh, no. Maybe not. Oh, where we go. The fires plus a little dumpy just destroying most of the tears that come at us. It's a fantastic pairing here. It really is. Look at the little dumpy blocking all the shots. Little dumpy has been the true MVP of this run. 
I love you, little dumpy. There you go. We did it. We did it. No need to go a little uh, to go to the delirium if we get it. We didn't. There you go. We have achieved big baby and dark baby. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. A very fun run, and I will see you guys in the next one.